got him. Yeah, much better. You can put slime stars, wires, actuators, other baits. I didn't know about um, actuators and wires. What happened last death? That was nuts. That was nuts. already got our fishing shack up though. Yeah. This is key, the fishing shack. Oh. I'm still not over that death. I was so attached after we beat the boss. I'm just glad that we beat the boss before something like that happened. I was worried about going into the jungle because who knows what's in the jungle. <laughs> well, the jungle actually was pretty good. We can set up fishing shacks around the world. Yeah, with toilets apparently. The journeyman bait kind of sucks. I think we'll call it there. Though I might wait. I'm probably gonna wait till morning. Or maybe I'll just go explore at night. We'll probably be okay. Let's see if we can make some more progress exploring with the power of our wooden yo-yo. Love this uh, sandstorm. Oh wait, I just realized it's just realized it's jungle hell. Uh, this might not work. Maybe it'll work if we could get out. Let's snag that moon glow. Oh, this thing is really nice to just get out of an area really fast. Which, when I'm stranded in the jungle, I seriously appreciate. Oh, I don't have enough inventory room for those grubs. Get these apprentice baits out of here, they suck. Oh. Frog. Oh. Get me out. Get me out. Hi, Ruby. This item is amazing for movement. Oh god, bees. Oh yeah, you don't get bees when it falls in the water, which is kind of cool. Um, I need to do something about my inventory though. Uh, what do I definitely not need? Mushroom. Ten jerkins. Inventory's a mess. Chance there's a chest right there. Oh god. Oh god, bad. Ah! Uh, pretty risky. Having to collect the hearts every time is such a drag. 
How it, starting with zero life is like, oh. <laughs> At least the Spelunker potions make it pretty fast and the explosives too. Um. Apparently this makes it so mobs don't spawn to put the wall in. Sounds good to me. Um, need to get some stuff out of my inventory right now. Sell some stuff too. Good morning from Guam. Welcome, uh, TX. Ah, uh, two gold worth of bass. There we go. That's the dynamite that I need. Grasshopper is not worth it. And Grubby's not worth it either. Get rid of our boomerang. We'll just use. We're using yo-yos this round. Two gold. Wow. All right. Well, dynamite dream is back in action. 19 silver. And if I move this guy underground, maybe he'll sell me cheaper dynamite. I should do that. Dynamite dream. 51 dynamite will get us to the bottom of the map. All right. <laughs> we got, oh, I should have checked if we had rope. Do we have enough rope? 160. Um, we should sell probably a few more things to get some rope. What do we want this to be? Housing. Housing stuff. Uh, weapons. Armor. Gills potion in there. Sell that. I might use these. I forgot to use the builder potion again. I'll try to remember to use it at some point. Same with the mining potion. Let's see, we need a couple more torches. That's kind of a problem right now. Or someone in a particular room. Um, you just go to this housing menu and you can put someone wherever. I didn't know and tell me that I put a go again. Um, maybe with the guide to get a pylon deep underground. Oh, will that actually work? Um, that sounds nice. Yeah. Um. Where the heck is the shopkeeper? Gotta be over here. We need torches. Oh, I wait, I might have some gel. We need rope. There we go. I can make these myself. We have plenty of gel. There we go. Oh, fuck that red devil. <laughs> I was messed up. I was messed up. All 
All right, down the shaft we go. Oh yeah, it's like weird spider land down here. Oh, we don't have any hard pieces yet, which is a bit of an issue as far as not just auto dying goes. Oh my gosh, 26 platinum more just sitting right there. So we can make spelunker potions with that, which is nice. Oh god, the spiders. Beware the spiders. Do not like that. No thanks. Oh my gosh, all this platinum. Hello? Well, we're getting some ore at least. So. Probably have a ton of stone blocks. I'll use those for digging stuff now. Mmm, spider nest. Wish when they explode. <laughs> How many glow sticks? Oh, I have 41 glow sticks. Totally worth just tossing a few. See if we see anything cool. I love the sound of spiders exploding in the morning. Oh, we found a bunch of platinum, if not any heart pieces. I've never feel like truly safe in pre-hard mode until, until I have about like 200 or 300 life and full platinum armor. Then I feel like, okay, I'm probably not going to just immediately die to something random. Everything while we have a chance. Oh, I don't want to get too close to that dynamite. But we made that mistake before. shaft down there all right whoa there's like a ton of gems what is that i've never seen this before hold on just a second i've never seen this like crazy gem area right here whoa huh Tons of diamonds and stuff. All right, uh, that's pretty cool. Can you mine them? You can mine them. Whoa, I've never seen this. Okay, I can't mine all of them. It's weird, I can mine some of this? I wonder if I hit it with the hammer if it would mine the ones in the background. Let's find out. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I guess that was just a background wall. Oh, uh, let's go collect all this stuff down here. One more dynamite. Get rid of that dude. Uh, 
snag all this stuff. Oh, the sand thing doesn't really work so well. Uh, oh, until I'm out of the water. Bad. See if we can find anything with the glow stick. There's a chest right there, that's good. The bat being a silly face right there. Um, I wanna get that chest. We also need to be somewhat careful. But I think it's safe to get. Oh, hello, Skellington. We can't get up here. Having the finch makes such a huge difference for just getting rid of stuff that would be getting on top of me. My surefire strategy that I'm not gonna step on a pressure plate or some shit. Oh god, salamander. Nope. <laughs> Alright, we'll have to go back for that in a second. Um, I believe we can make a grapple though. Let's see. lots of Dayblum for iron skin potions, so I'll get it for now. Uh, this water leaf is not yet ready, right? No, it's gotta be raining. It's gotta be raining. Alright, we wait for the rain. 11 diamonds. Um, alright, well we didn't get <laughs> 15 of an ore. Can't step on a trap if there's no floor. Yeah, Blink Root is really good. Were there some, any tip for new players? I guess it just depends on, uh, oh yeah, listening to the guide is probably the best. You admire our perseverance, thank you. Having told mining, just blow it up. Exactly. Just blow it up. Um, well, we can probably get another piece of, oh, maybe we could do it. Okay, I guess we guess we've experimented with magic. Hmm. I could do the diamond sword or the platinum sword, but I think I'll just save for platinum armor. Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, got some silt. Minecart track. We have 12 rubies. So I'm probably gonna sell. Ah, uh, problem is I don't know which one to sell. Do the diamonds sell for a lot more? Let's see. Let me see if there's anything to do with these gems. Diamonds. Diamond robe. Diamond hook. Phase blade. So basically you can make a magic mirror out of the diamonds, but not super useful. All right, did the diamonds sell for more? Nope, they sell for, oh, they do sell for a little bit more, but only a little bit. All right, I'll save one diamond in case I ever want it for like a gem corn or something, and otherwise <laughs> explosives. Let's grab that chest. It should be safe enough to grab. Diamond hook. I figure I'll get a hook. I didn't have enough to make it or I would have. All right, the yo-yo does like, I hope I get one with maybe more knockback or something. Cause it is kind of hard to keep him away from me. I didn't know it's the wooden one still. This is a little unsafe, but here we go. We're probably just gonna dive into that chest. Oh, <laughs> all that for an inner tube. You love to see it. Oh man, all that for an inner tube. All right. 
Oh, finally, the inner tube of our dreams. We can fish even better. The game just keeps telling me to fish a little bit more. Um, dynamite. Sharkbait is a pet. It is. I still don't really know what this like moss or stuff is or whatever. Oh, well, all right. I will mine this. Thank you for knocking me down here. <laughs> Thing comes flying through the air and hits my head. Die, please. What's in there? Yeah, that's an interesting area. I don't know if I know what that area is. Weird, I'm still discovering new stuff like that. A lot to this game. Did I miss any gems, maybe? Hmm. Oh, there's a heart piece right there. Let's go. That's nice. All right, first heart piece. Oh, extra health. Thank you very much. Platinum above to the right. Oh, where did I miss it? Thank you. Let me try to find it. Um. Was it? Ah, uh, there it is. Thank you very much. Another gem cave? Yeah. What is? Is there? Is that gem? I guess I'll go get all the emeralds. Hopefully, I'll be safe enough. Looks like there's a buttload of emeralds. Is this emeralds too? Yeah, that's just a boatload of emeralds. Okay, that's gotta be enough to make our thingy thing at least. So many emeralds. Wow. All right. This is the seed of the gems. Cool. So that's just an emerald area. I've never seen either of these before. Now I see both of them. That's weird. It's kind of weird. I'm pretty sure I can make my hook. Um, 41 emeralds. <laughs> Whoa. This hole is almost done. May as well just finish it off. I'll save one dynamite in case we need to get any enemies with it. More gems. Honestly, the gems are good for selling for more dynamite, so yes, please. Right no, that's like silver or something. Might still be worth getting though. Uh, Carl, if you could romance one character for lower fees. Ah, uh, the mechanic. <laughs> uh, I don't know if we need silver for anything. Worm incoming. All right. Okay. 
one more explosion down here and then we'll grab the loot and that is it for this spot for now cool we got some demonite ore <laughs> randomly um, we can make a hook let's do a emerald hook this time yeah emerald hook and then so is there any reason to keep the gems like i'm not gonna make the intro magic items or whatever or should i i don't know it feels like there's no reason to keep them um platinum topaz has a use specifically okay let me try topaz Let me give Topaz to the guide. Um, sand gun. Multicolored stained glass. Because I can get a lot of money selling all those. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to sell them. We're going to have planning to decorate. I, I do want to do that um, eventually. But um, as I mentioned before, I always like to do new progress and then we decorate and then we get new progress and then we decorate. Let's see, it's straight up five defense for that. We'll do that, that sounds nice. Mm. <laughs> we'll just, uh, you know, make a couple of these. These toilets here. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Is the prediction over? Um, it says full iron or lead armor. So I still need a helmet. If once I have um, if once I have iron or better in my helmet slot, then it'll be over. Yeah, I mean four gold. Yes, please. I guess I should have saved one of each to grow them if I ever wanted to, but whatever. Jester's arrows seem like they might be a good strategy for worms. Am I on crimson? I don't even remember. Or am I on corruption? I'm on corruption. Oh, let's get our moon glow. It's night. Three moon glow seeds, you love to see it. Maybe growing them is good for the dynamite budget. That's a good point. for now because we're not using a bow um vanity stuff uh, aesthetics the inner tube can save my life What's the current priority? Um, getting money for dynamite to excavate areas to get heart pieces. Uh, I would really like to find blink root. I feel like I probably missed it while we were spelunking, but getting blink root would be key right now for getting spelunker potions. I'm curious to know about the hundred torches in a cave. Don't behave, Mothcar already knows. Yeah, I. I don't mind knowing about stuff like that. Like, I'm, I don't know. Should I do it? If I'm just going to die, I'm not going to do it. Easter eggs are totally fine with me. Let's see. We need to get a little bit more rope, but we also need at least, at least 50 dynamite. Um, let's get some more rope though. The dynamite is actually a goal.
need a couple hundred of that. Um, may as well make what I can and some torches. What else do I want? <clears throat> Got enough glow sticks. Honestly, we're pretty good. Let's get more torches. I think we're good. Do you want to get to 400 HP or something? <clears throat> Uh, it doesn't get any harder, so I'd recommend doing it after Skeletron. Okay, cool. To get heart bases, blink root chest, and other valuables, you can make horizontal tunnels. Um, but then it's not safe because of... Uh, I, I, I do that with a Spelunker potion or a da and a Dangerous Dance potion. Never without them, or else there's a real fat chance of me dying to something. <laughs> like a boulder. Oh. <clears throat> Vertical is safe, horizontal is unsafe, unless I have a potion on. Or a, if I could... If I had a pressure plate to hold, then it's like okay to see the wires, I guess. Um, but even against the enemies, it's not amazingly safe until I get a couple more heart pieces. So I, I like to do it like this uh, until I get a couple more heart pieces. I might do... Oh, uh, an ice biome would be nice. It'd be nice to see what else is over here. This jungle goes on forever, though. It's really jungly down there. I might just start another cave here. Oh, is that ice? Wait, oh no, that's mushroom right there. What is that? Um, yeah, I might start another one like right here. I'm not sure if there's any real advantage to going into the lava down here anymore. Amethyst. Um, does blink root show on the map? <laughs> what all shows on this map? Hey, it does. Death bloom, water leaf. What color would blink root be? Right now, getting like one piece of blink root would be huge. Um, appreciate the commitment to the poop shoot. I guess it's just a question of if we start a new hole or... I'm kind of feeling starting a new one here. Exploring more laterally would be good. I can probably survive running through the crimson area, but I'm not going to do it at night, so... It's the middle of the night. The other option is fishing, but I don't have a good place to fish here. Yeah. Don't think there's a great place to fish yet. Oh, there is the fishing hole right there. Maybe that's where I... I maybe I should build something here for the... Um, still more emeralds there. Well, that is the fishing hole of our dreams right there. Maybe we should build a little fishing thing right there. Uh, do I have enough bait, though? I actually don't think I have enough bait. Let's see. Do I even have, like, any? Hi, Ruby. Ladybugs? No, we're not doing it. No ladybugs. No, I don't have any bait. Man, that sucks. Uh, it's slow. I know how to make a fishing pole or fishing thing by uh, just transferring around water. Um, I will, I will probably do that like to have to have a fishing area in every biome if I want to. Um, but the problem is I have no bait right now, and I mean I can catch these fireflies. Now, nerd. Oh my god, I need to get some better weapons too. <laughs> I should just get the platinum broadsword. How good are the fireflies? 20%? That's not terrible. Hmm. I don't see any more fireflies. Yeah, I don't see any more fireflies. Is there one right there? There is. Kind of hard to see. I gotta find more fireflies or not really? I can't see anything. Oh, we can get some worms. I don't think I realized these rocks were back. Oh, I guess that's all of them. 
did do do. We have an umbrella. Yeah, true. Oh gosh, tons of dudes. Just want worms. Just want more worms. Um, I don't know if we saw any puddles. Let me see if I saw any puddles on the map. Nothing there. Any puddles? For Sky Islands? Nope. <laughs> I think that's a big no. Maybe there. So maybe there's a Sky Island above it? Or is that just a normal jungle pond? Maybe a Sky Island. Maybe. But those just look like normal jungle ponds, potentially. Now it's being taught to new players. Well, we could do a little fishing. Wait, I can actually make the explosive bunny? <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. It's just dynamite and a bunny. Amazing. We never got to experience the joys of that yet. It's not really enough bait. Well, for lack of something better to do, I am just gonna start hole number two. Courtesy of 50 sticks of dynamite. This run is like an hour or two or something. Carl, we have an unhealthy obsession with dynamite. Look, it's the fastest way to mine, all right? How long without it taking me to dig? It's also safe. It's the thing about it. It's very safe. Until I blow myself up with the dynamite. From not paying attention. Guys out of here. Let's see if there's anything down there. I don't think so. Thank <laughs> you. 
Get out of here. Sadly, no more dynamite. Got some bombs though. I didn't see a pressure plate yet. I might have picked one up and sold it early game, but I don't remember. It would be nice to have a pressure plate because then I could explore laterally without getting a uh, potion. If I could just sell this silver. <laughs> For more dynamite. <laughs> oh, yeah, during the day, we just need to explore more, too. We haven't explored hardly any of the surface yet. I probably can just jump over the, uh... Oh, lots of silt here. If we get an extractinator, that would be very nice. Tons of silt. Alright, it's daytime, though. Let's go exploring. Maybe we could get an iron helmet. Let's see. Or some kind of a helmet. Oh yeah, surely we can. All right, let's snag a silver helmet and that'll be the end of the prediction. We got full, we got full stuff. Um, well, I get uh, 200, well I get to 200 health. Wait, how much do I have 120? I have 120 health. Will I get to 200 health? Uh, you can just smash one over for a guaranteed gun. Yeah, I know about that. Um, it's very nice to have that ranged weapon. I often do that. I've done that many games in the past. Blink root seeds! Let's Let's heck and go. All right, we're gonna be able to get potions soon, so this is actually really good. Um, I think I've got basically everything already growing there, actually. Pretty much everything I could want. Which is very nice. Try HP by when? Uh, <laughs> I'll either get it or not, or I'll die trying. It, it, the prediction ends if I die and the run ends, or if I get 200 life. One or the other. Um, all right, how are we doing on everything? Use a little more rope, but otherwise we're good. <clears throat> okay, I mainly just need to go exploring. Let's go exploring through the crimson area. Actually, do I have a hammer? I wouldn't, I just need a couple explosives. Let me sell my tin. Um, a couple explosives would help me potentially sneak in there and snag some stuff. Though, you know, is there anything else I was going to sell? I could sell the sandcastle thing for more dynamite. We might do it. <laughs> I'll just buy bombs. Alright, 31 bombs is at least enough. Mostly need to just get out of this area, but let's take a nice little quick peek down here. See if we can. Oh god. Um, I should probably just explore instead of doing this. Um, mainly because the weapon isn't going to help us actually yet. Like, I don't need the weapon yet. Oh. Oh. Actually, yeah, the weapon's not gonna really help us. Oh, is that it? <laughs> well, that was a goofy area. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, let's toss a glow stick. 
Slime is falling. Oh my god, slime rain. All right, I don't think I can take the slime king right now. So we're going to have to just not fight the slime king as much as I would like to. As nice as it might be. All worms, though. Oh, wow. This is interesting. Uh, this is actually cool. Absolutely, I'll take that out. Um, smashy, smashy. Yeah, all right. Well, now we got a musket, which is nice. Um, I'll come back to the yo-yo hopefully soon. Musket's nice. It does so much damage. Um, is there more crimson over here? Yeah, there's a bunch of orbs and stuff over here. These things don't have any loot, do they? Is it those that do? No. Star power. Increase maximum mana. Uh, not the play right now. Not the play right now. That was fun though. The musket's pretty huge, I have to say. Oh, that does have worms in it. Let's go. The fishing dream. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. This thing just like one shot stuff. It does so much damage. But I have to aim. <laughs> that is a downside. Holy moly, it's raining worms. It's also raining slimes. I forgot about that. Slime rain going on. This is going to be a little bit more difficult. Oh, yeah, we probably. I mean, with this weapon, we could almost take the slime king, but I have no HP. Is the problem? I just have zero HP for that. You know, there's a couple slimes out there. All right, let's get out of here. Let's. Get out. Run. Is that death weed? No. I forget if these mushrooms are useful for anything. Take some of this. Oh, here's the ice biome. Buy your shinies. The fossil armor is a good raindrop, and before any bosses, you can just mine fossils and farm the enemies. 
For the fishing team, you notice that monsters don't spawn around your base. That is the town effect by having th oh, it has to be three. This is negated by a blood moon. Okay, I didn't know you needed three, Jude. That's cool. Very good to note. Uh, ow. Eh. Oh, I ran out of muskets. Um. Ran out of muskets. Well, I would like to explore more, but uh, <laughs> the slime rain is not helping that. Maybe we just go farm some slimes for items or uh, for gold and stuff. I don't know. I need the dude to move in before I can buy some muskets. I mean, I'm not gonna be able to get out of here. It's not gonna help. Why are we on attempt 30? Uh, could we die? <laughs> yeah. Must have died. 700 slimes later. I would like to keep exploring, but I don't think I can think of a way to do it with all this slime rain. So let's just kill slimes here. Can buy some musket balls. Sweet. Uh, let's plant some seeds. What seed is that? Oh, that's just regular seeds. We don't want that. Bird. Blowpipe. Yeah, shiver thorn. I even had 200 health, I'd try fighting the Slime King. But I don't. I do not. Um, put stuff away. Enchanted night crawlers do I have? Oh enough. Absolutely enough. Oh I gotta put a bottle on a table still. For our alchemy dream. Wait, the alchemy dream was supposed to be right here. Get this thing out of here. There we go. Still enough to do with that keg one day. What are my what's my trinket situation like? It's pretty shit. 2% damage. It's all pretty bad. All right, we'll come back to the yo-yos as soon as we get anything else to equip on them, I guess. Right now we're lacking in the yo-yo department. Let's do trinkets. Box. Materials. What is your favorite style of fighting so far? Um, when melee worked, I loved it, but it's hard to get it to work because I'm not. Well, yeah, getting close to stuff is kind of uh, <laughs> it's kind of scary. I would love to see somebody do like a hardcore. A hardcore melee master mode or expert mode playthrough. I would love to watch that where they don't cheese any of the bosses and they actually just melee everything. That'd be nuts. Does anybody know if there's like a if that's such a run exists somewhere like on YouTube or anywhere? That would be epic if that exists. If so, uh, feel free to drop a link. I would love to uh, check that out at some point. 
Melee is actually safer in some ways. That's interesting. I mean, you do have more defense, but nothing would have, no amount of defense would have helped me. Uh, uh, I'll come, come back to those for more alchemy shenanigans later. Okay, I am going to go make a underground fishing dream house down there. Uh, true melee is even worse. You can't even use the projectiles for melee weapons. <laughs> Wait to Carl watches a weaponless run. But see, here's the thing. Like, if you just cheese stuff, then I'm not that. It's like, I know there's going to be, in every game, always, since I've done speedrunning for a long time, there's always ways to manipulate the boss's AI, to like build the right sort of thing so that you can't take damage or that, that you just like, you know, I don't know what it would be in this game. I was thinking dynamite would probably be a pretty big boss cheese if you could just consistently hit it. Um, so like, as long as you have the right strategy, I understand that all those things work, but I don't want to kill the bosses with cheese. I want to kill them. I want to see somebody do it, you know, like with the legit fight. I'd be much more impressed by that than I would be by the cheese. The cheese is just is cool to come up with, but then once you've come up with it, it's not interesting anymore. Or that, like, that's how I feel about it. Uh, let's build a thing over our head. In case we <laughs> run into a uh, unexpected trap or something. I guess it shouldn't be able to happen because of the pressure plates, right? <laughs> Woo! All right, fishing dream house, let's go. Can I put three rooms in this? I need to be extended a little bit for three rooms. Interesting. I'm trying to put more housing everywhere in case the crimson or whatever just like knocks one out. Um, fish safety housing, yes, very much so, <laughs> very much so. Look at how safe we are. We just have some nice fishing down here. Uh, Mr. Steffi has done hardcore master melee. Uh, Duran SD also has done a bunch of theme specific runs that are worth watching. I would be down for anybody who's yeah. done hardcore expert on master if they show it. I would love to watch um, up until the point that I'm at. That would be really fun to watch to see what they've done. Get it together is what your wife and you say when the other sneezes. I love that. <laughs> uh, that's wonderful. Stone walls. <laughs> I'm stealing. I am stealing that. That's so good. Um, people have done hardcore master on every class without cheese. If there are runs of it, it'd be really fun to watch. Uh, see how. See if anybody has different strategies to me uh, up until the points that I've gotten to. Uh, I'm sure to cover up the lake uh, and fill in the off-screen areas below the cover with walls to ward off enemies. Oh, that's a cool idea about building the wall everywhere to ward off enemies. Huh. That's cool. I might look into doing that more, I suppose. Let's not walk outside there and die right now, though. Um, right. I got my toilet ready. <laughs> Uh, I can't tell if chat's trolling me or if this actually works. Uh, strategy vicious, I basically worked out. We beat one of the bosses and I think I would have beaten any of them. Can I talk about the bunny cheese since he won't do it? Yeah, I don't care about, you can talk about cheese. That's totally fine. Cause I, yeah, I'm not going to do it. 
that's been patched. There's melee versus true melee. I see. Your challenges don't use cheese. Ooh, Durin, I gotta go check that out. Um, do you have a YouTube channel or where's the best place to watch them? If you cover the world in walls, the enemies not spawn anymore. Does the toilet count as a chair? Hold on. Does the toilet count as a chair? Please tell me it does. <laughs> Is this suitable housing? Let me see. Oh, come on, suitable. Yes, it's suitable. <laughs> missing a chair, missing a toilet, you mean. Oh, that's amazing. I love it. Um, okay. I wonder if I can fish through a one tile gap. I know I can through a uh, two tile. Amazing. All right, let's see if we can sit here. All right, we sit down on the toilet. We bust out our nice fishing pole. Oh, the one tile might not work. I think we need the two tile. Oops, I just uh, annihilated that. There we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot we can fish a bomb fish. Also, the finch is literally less stupid than the imps. What the heck? The imps would just abandon me. The bats will come up the sewer pipes. <laughs> Any item in the game from breaking doors. What the heck? That's an amazing glitch. You think it's possible? I was thinking maybe if I weren't sitting down on the toilet. But we are because apparently it provides a fishing buff to sit on the toilet. Oh, it's nice to see 100 HP on things instead of 1400 on that red devil or whatever. I definitely want to do the uh, old ones army and get some sentries too. Um, do 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 do. Uh, learning how a boss behaves is just something you learn after fighting it for years and years. Or just loading up a script for reacting and dodging. Something that's cool about the bosses in this game is you, it doesn't seem like you can, um... Oh! The bat's in. Um, let's see, I might try to... This could be a little risky, but... There we go. I wonder, actually, I wonder if it makes it harder for them to get in if they don't have like a little net right there. But yeah, I like the bosses in this game because they're pretty unpredictable. You can't, it doesn't seem like you could just, some for some games, the bosses will like behave exactly the same every time. And while you can do that to some extent, for sure in this game, like for some bosses, you just, it feels like for some bosses, you want to just run straight. And for other bosses, you want to like go up and around them and stuff. Is sitting on the road actually give a fishing bonus? Apparently it does. And it's way safer than just floating in my inner tube. It also counts as a chair. Mmm, two gold. Did you know that putting down an enemy banner gives yourself 100% uh, damage against them? Um, yeah, but I've not found a good way to use it. Maybe if I were farming in hard mode. I didn't know that it reduced damage to me though. That's awesome. Like, if, I've, if I'm able to kill 50 of an enemy, then I don't need the banner anymore, if that makes sense. Uh, so far. I've, like, I've never found a way where I've been like, man, I just wish that, you know, this particular mob did less damage to me.
But in hard mode, I can see it being really good. I wonder if it, um... Yeah, yeah, in hard mode it sounds good. Have I gotten a banner for anything in hard mode? Um, I could see it being really good for like, if the goblin invasion is like, let's say the goblin invasion is way harder in hard mode and I still have the goblin banners up from pre-hard mode, that sounds really good. Um, something like that kind of a situation sounds good to me. But I've not yet run into a situation where I fight a lot of one mob that I've already got a banner for that where that mob has killed me or like been difficult to fight. Maybe for the old ones events or like the goblins or something like that. The mobs tend to be replaced with harder versions that the banners don't count for. See, that's what I thought. I'm assuming I can get another one though. Like, what I could do is I could build a box and then, you know, safely farm, let's say, 50 turtles. And then put down the turtle banner. Then... But then, like, if I'm already farming them for my box... Like, I don't have the banners while I'm exploring, though. I could do that, but... Oh. Eh. Whoopsies. I had it. Oh, yeah, shit. Um... Let's see. Uh, ice cream truck. I have a uh, thing I forgot about. Um, I have to take a 10 minute break in a couple of minutes. But, uh, if nightmares are that long. Yeah, it's like the default alarm. <laughs> Switch to Twitch plays Terraria. That would be impossible. <laughs> I'd like to watch it. All right. Well, anyway, our fishing hole is looking nice. Obsidian. Wow, we've already got our obsidian skin potions for later. That's really nice. We got some armored cave fish for later. Cool. Be good to actually make some food. I haven't been eating anything. Um. All right, I'll just snag like one or two more fish. Might not be sitting on the toilet. Oh yeah, I got off. Accidentally. Stova Wovo, thank you so much for the sub. Does it flush directly into the water you're fishing from? I love it. I wonder if there's any loot worth grabbing down there from all the stuff this guy does. Oh my gosh, yeah. Don't mind me while I just snag all that. Do -do 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 -do. All right. Well, we still are in pretty desperate need of some additional heart pieces. That feels like the main thing we're missing right now. Let's make a cooking pot and I can actually get some food at least though. But everything else is looking pretty good. Uh, can I make a cooking pot? Yeah, let's do a cooking pot. Hmm. Probably just gonna sell all of my tin for Oh, this blue jellyfish, I think, is actually worth a lot of money. Is it? Yeah, it's worth three gold. That's pretty nice. Let's toss down our cooking pot. Hmm, seafood dinner. 
Oh, I don't want to make it from the cave fish though. The specular fish, definitely. And then the, this is just from the bats. I might just eat those for now. Okay, we saved the armored cave fish. That goes in the alchemy chest. Yeah. Uh, let's just eat these for now until we get better stuff. Bomb fish are nice. Housing stuff. Alright, we're basically out of bait though. These apprentice baits suck. They're not, not worth it. Get them out of my sight. Too slow. But we'll put the obsidian skin away for now. Um, waiting for our blink root to grow. Yeah, I think what we'll do is when the blink root grow, uh, then we will be able to use spelunker potions. And I think I have some shiver thorn growing too. Okay. Um, let's see. Uh, guy from Oklahoma, thank you so much for the sub too. Thank you, CC. Thank you, Vinny. Everybody I missed, very much appreciated. Um, okay, so I have to go make a phone call, and I don't know how long it'll take. It'll probably take five or ten minutes. So uh, I will be back in just a moment. Feel free to take a break. <laughs> 